everyone, this is Camille. Today, I'm gonna teach you how to make a paint brush transition. You can apply this to any of your videos. If you are interested in this, keep watching. Firstly, let's prepare some video clips and a paintbrush green screen clip. You can click on here and then select the files for import. Then we add a video number 1 onto the video track. Trim its length and let it to be around 5 seconds. Next. Let's make the green screen clip enter from left and move to the right. We drag the green screen clip onto the overlay track and make its duration the same as that of the video number 1. Then we go to the inspector panel and choose fade to screen height. Now let's click on here to enter the motion editor. We need to make the green screen clip look like it's moving from left to right. Let's click on here to add the first keyframe. Then we move the selection box to the right of the green screen part. Then we add a second keyframe at this point. Move the selection box left and make the green screen part take two-thirds of the entire screen. Last, we add a keyframe at the end point. We're almost there. Next, let's select Speed Up as the speed mode for the first keyframe. And choose Speed Down for the second keyframe. Now we see only the movements of the green screen. Let's export this clip. To make everything more clear, we name it Video A. Next, let's import the Video A onto Video Prog Blogger. Now, let's remove all the clips on the timeline. And then add a Video number 2 onto the video track. Pull the video A to the overlay track and choose the fade to screen height icon on the inspector panel. Now we can notice part of the green screen clip blocks the video number 2 which located and is behind. Let's go to the inspector panel on the right and scroll down to find the green screen. Select enabled. Now the video number 2 becomes visible. Let's take a look. Mm, we've made the first paintbrush effect. Next, let's make the brush effect enter from the right and move to the left. Just like what we did before, we drag the paintbrush green screen clip onto the overlay track and make its duration the same as the video number 2. Then we come over to the inspector panel and choose Fatal Screen Height. Then let's click on here to enter the motion editor. We click on here to add a first keyframe. Like what we did before, but in the opposite direction. We move the selection box to the left of the green screen. Then we add a second keyframe at this point and move the selection box left to make the green screen part take around two-thirds of the entire screen. Then we add a keyframe at the end point. Next, we select Speed Up as the speed mode for the first keyframe and choose Speed Down for the second keyframe. That's it.
surely we can get this done in an easier way. Select the green screen clip we made for the first time. Choose horizontal flip on the inspector panel. By doing this, we can quickly get a green screen animation clip shown on the right. Then, like what we did before, we export this clip and name it as video B. Add it to the program. Put a video number 3 on a video track. Add a video B to the overlay track. Set its properties and enable the green screen effect. Based on your need, you can make many paint brush effects. It's super easy to do, isn't it? You can add this effect to any video you have, try it yourself. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for getting the latest news and tutorials from VideoProc Flagger. You can go to the homepage of our channel to find more awesome video editing tutorials. Hope you enjoyed it and see you in our next video. Bye!